Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I will be talking about the Boya BYM3 Digital Lavalier Microphones. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and let's get started. Bakit ba ako bumili nito? Because uh, my phone is Samsung Galaxy Note 10 and it has um, Type-C. So this microphone is a has a Type-C adapter that you can connect to your phone. So I will be sharing with you what's in the box, comparison of um, with and without microphone, and also the pros and cons of using this lavalier microphone. So the package contents are the BYM3 lapel mic, foam windscreen, clothing clip, Velcro, carrying pouch, and user manual. So I got this mic from Shopee. Ang shop is smallcenter.ph. So ito siya. And uh, ang, bil ang original price is 1412 and um, tinawaran ko yung seller. Una, tinanong ko muna siya kung compatible ba to sa um, Samsung Galaxy Note 10. Though, alam ko compatible talaga siya. Pero, tinanong ko na rin. And then, after that, tumawad ako. So, 141 to original price. And then, I offered 1,200. So, tinanggap naman niya. Kaya, this is a good bargain. So, I ordered this uh, May 14. May 14. And it arrived May 22. So, um, hindi rin naman ganun katagal kasi wala rin naman ako pupuntahan, no? So, naantay ko talaga siya. This is what it sounds like um, with the lavalier. Kadiri, tumutulo na ilong ko. This is what it sounds like using the microphone. Note all Android applications can support USB external microphone. When this is what it sounds like minus the mic. Not all Android applications can support USB external microphone when you take a video. So, what are the pros and cons of um, this Boya mic, lavalier mic? So, first pro is the price. So, 1,200 lang. Kung compare mo siya sa distributor ng Boya mic dito sa Pilipinas, mura na yung pagkakabili ko. So, that's 1,200. Or pagpalagay na natin 1,400. So, first pro is the price. Second is um, yung pinaka... How do you call this? Yung pinaka-cord niya. So, this is 6 meters long. And, so, kahit na malayo sa akin yung camera, alam mo yun, hindi ako mauubusan ng, ng length ng cord. And this cord comes with, yan, may velcro na siya para at least madali mong i-organize yung um, cord. Though, medyo naninipisan ako sa cord, hindi ko lang sure kung ganito lahat ng um, lavalier mic, pero medyo naninipisan ako sa kanya. But other than that, wala naman akong problema sa kanya. Um, ano pa bang pros? Siyempre, isang pro kasi gumagana siya, ba So, less hassle na ng, let's say, babalik ko pa sa supplier, ay sa pinagbilhan ko, or ganyan-ganyan. Or, um, at least, binasa siya. So, I'm definitely sure lahat ng mga naka-Samsung Galaxy Note 10, uh, Note 10 Plus, um, S10, S10 Plus, and above, eto, babasahin to sa inyo. Yung mga naka 3.5mm jack, definitely babasahin siya. And what are the cons to this microphone? So first, kasi hindi ko to first time ginamit. Ginamit ko na to sa isang um, past uh, video ko kasi nga gusto kong matesting bago ko ipakita sa inyo. So, um, ang napapansin ko sa kanya, hindi totoo na noise, na noise canceling siya. Maybe, um, kapag ka, pag, pag hindi ako nasasalita, maririnig nyo yung um, aircon. Yan. Pero once magsalita na ako, um, yung boses ko na yung nakaka-capture. Parang na-overpower niya na yung ingay. Pero um, when I, uh, I edit, naririnig ko pa rin yung tunog ng aircon. So, hindi siya talaga noise cancelling. Pero at least, um, I am delivering a better audio kesa sa wala talaga akong ginagamit na mic. So, that's a con. Isa pang con is... Um, Kapag, uh, let's say, madami kami mag-shoot, I mean, hindi lang ako isa, alam mo, tatlo, dalawa, apat kami. So, ako lang yung may lapel. So, sila wala silang audio. You, you know, I, I mean, I, paano, hindi ko alam kung paano yung gagawin ko pagka ganun. Or kung masasagap din ba yung uh, salita nila ng maayos kapag may iba kong kasama na mag-vlog. So, that's a con. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. Um, I hope you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And... I'll see you on my next one. Bye!